Oh, I cannot wait to eat this. Wait, hold on. Oh, it's Ryan. Ryan asks, hey, Dr. Ion, I'm really bored and I want a fun activity that's entertaining and educational. Hmm, I think I can do you one better. How about we do an activity that's fun, educational, entertaining, and delicious, starting with these. All right, let's go. Welcome to Ryan's world. Dr. Ion, what's the emergency? Are you okay? Wait a minute. Everything looks fine, huh? No, oh, I thought you said this was an emergency. It looks like you're just getting ready to cook. Oh, is there grits? I mean, yes. This is an emergency. We're doing an experiment. What could be more important? I was in the middle of breakfast. And I was just about to. Uh 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 uh. You won't want to miss out. Today, we're making sugar crystals. Let's get Ionic. Whoa, I love sugar crystals. I've been meaning to make them for a while. I know about sugar, but what are sugar crystals? Ah, good question. So sugar crystals are made up of tiny bits of sugar that come together to form bigger crystals under certain conditions. And today we're gonna figure out which conditions those are. Whoa, I can't wait. Let's do this. Whoa, Peck, I've never seen you so animated before. I like it. Before we start the experiment, don't you wanna learn more about sugar? Oh, yeah. Yes, please. Oh yeah. What is it exactly? And where does it come from? Sugar comes from plants like sugar cane and sugar beet. It's used as a sweetener in many foods and drinks, including my breakfast. Wow, so that's where sugar comes from? Now I'm even more excited to make these sugar crystals. <laughs> Let's get started. Right on Peck, loving the vibe. For this experiment, we're gonna need a pot, some sugar, some water, measuring cups, jars of water, some sticks, and food coloring. Before this next part, it's really important that you always have an adult on hand and that you wear proper safety equipment. First, we're gonna turn on the stove top, add a fourth cup of water, two and a half cups of sugar, and then we're gonna mix until the sugar fully dissolves. Once our sugar is fully dissolved, we're gonna coat these sticks with our mixture. After coating the stick with the dissolved sugar, we're gonna place some dry sugar on top of it. We're gonna do this two more times, and we're gonna let this cool down for an hour. We're going to make our second batch of saturated sugar solution. This is gonna be nine parts sugar, one part water. As always, make sure there's an adult to help you out. All right, ready? Well, that looks fun. That is a lot of sugar. Once it's fully dissolved, we have to wait and leave the mixture to cool for 15 minutes. And once our sugar is fully dissolved, we're going to carefully put on some gloves and evenly distribute the solution into three separate jars. Next, we're gonna add some food coloring. All right, in this first one, we're gonna put blue. In the second one, we're gonna put orange. Ooh. And this last one, we're gonna put in purple. Whoa. Careful, the mixture may still be very hot. Now comes the fun part. Right, we're gonna place a stick into each jar. Make sure to suspend your stick so they don't touch the bottom of the jar. You could use clamps, clothespins, or whatever you can find at home. And now, we wait. Well, how long? I mean, I got stuff to do. Uh, a couple minutes, hours, or days. Several days later. Oh, hey, welcome back everyone. Oh, it's been a while. Peck couldn't even make it. He had to go to sleep, he was so tired. Should we wait for him? I mean, it would be the nice thing to do. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did say it would take a while, but it's all worth it because look, check it out. Wow, those look so pretty. You can see each of the crystals. 
Whoa! This is so pretty. Look at the structure. You can see the little cubes yeah. that are forming. Oh, wow. Ooh, now look at that. This is a thick one. Yeah, the purple looks like, you know how you can crack like certain rocks open and it reveals like that sparkly purple gem? Uh, that's yeah. what that one looks like. I knew you'd like that. So I've been preparing this for quite a while. Oh, wow. <laughs> Let's check it out. Can you help me, Dr. Bloom? Yes. All right, three, two, one. Oh, whoa! Oh, so pretty! Oh, hey, gang! Uh, I see you started without me. Okay, okay. I see why Peck was so excited now. I mean, these are so nice to look at and they seem delicious, but why do sugar crystals form and why are they crystals? Ooh, science time! Uh, Dr. Adam, we got you a question. <laughs> How are we gonna do it? And it is stuck in there. Oh no! <laughs> it tastes like sugar. <laughs> well, you know how sometimes you see pretty sparkly things like diamonds or gems? Well, those are crystals too. But those took millions of years to form. These took about a week to form. How does the shape form? So the shape of the crystal depends on the molecular structure of the mineral. In our sugar crystals experiment, two things are happening. First, adding heat to the water causes it to disappear over time. This is called evaporation. Second, as the water cools down, the dissolved sugar in the solution begins to turn solid again, forming a crystal structure. This is called precipitation. Uh, I can take this one. We see this in nature in the form of rain, with water going up into the clouds and then raining down back to Earth, sometimes in the form of snow. Oh, which is a crystal. I get it now. <laughs> right on, Dr. Bloom. Wait, but how do they attach to the stick? Imagine lots of tiny sugar molecules moving around the water, bumping into each other and sticking to each other. The sugar molecules stick to the lolly stick and pull other sugar molecules towards them. This is because the water is super saturated with sugar. Wow, I never knew all this about sugar. <laughs> it can be pretty sweet, huh, Dr. Ion? <laughs> uh, Peck! What? I missed out on breakfast again because of this. Oh, Peck. <laughs> Well, crew, we hope you had so much fun experimenting and learning about sugar crystals with us. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye. Mm, science, sweet science. All right, this is a VO a voiceover. Now that it's dry, look at it. <laughs> I know it, Darian. Whoa, 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 Perk. Make sure there's no go. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Hello? <laughs>